How to prevent and recognize symptoms of swine flu. Some common sense precautions can help keep you safe from this potentially deadly infection, also known as H1N1 influenza. You will need hand washing, knowledge of symptoms, prompt medical attention, isolation, and a face mask. Step one, understand what it is. Swine flu is a respiratory disease of pigs caused by the influenza virus. Usually, the virus does not affect humans, but transmission can sometimes occur in persons with direct exposure to pigs. The current outbreak has been caused by human-to-human -human transmission. Step two, swine flu is spread between humans like a cold. A person can catch it by being sneezed, coughed, or breathed on by a carrier, or by touching a surface that has the virus on it and then touching their nose, eyes, or mouth. Direct contact with infected pigs can also transmit the virus to people and vice versa. So far, no other animals can transmit the virus to humans. You cannot get swine flu from eating cooked pork or pork products. Step three, wash your hands with warm water and soap often, lathering up for as long as it takes you to sing happy birthday twice or about 20 seconds. Use hand sanitizer in between and avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Don't shake hands with anyone. Step four, if someone is showing signs of a cold or flu, keep your distance. Step five, don't assume you're immune to the swine flu because you got a flu shot last year. It may not prevent you from being made sick by this particular strain, though it could prevent you from catching other strains. Unlike other flu viruses, which tend to attack weakened immune systems, swine flu flourishes in young, strong, healthy bodies. Step six, know the symptoms, which include a fever higher than 100 degrees, body aches, coughing, a sore throat, and respiratory congestion. Some people have diarrhea and vomiting too. Step seven, don't delay in getting medical attention if you show symptoms. Swine flu can be successfully treated with the antiviral drugs Tamiflu and Relenza, which are most effective when taken within 48 hours of the onset of symptoms. Step eight, if you are diagnosed with any kind of flu, stay indoors and limit your interaction with loved ones for seven days after the onset of symptoms to avoid passing it to others. Step nine, if you are in an area where there's been a swine flu outbreak, wear a face mask. Swine flu is spread through respiratory droplets, which are transferred by a cough, sneeze, or even an exhale. A simple face mask filters about 62% of small particles. A professional grade one keeps about 98% out. Step 10, don't panic if you recently visited an area with an outbreak. The incubation period is three to five days, so if you're flu-free a week after your trip, you're probably not infected. Did you know? The World Bank has estimated that in a worst-case scenario, a flu pandemic could cost the world economy $3 trillion.